Uh, today's segment, instructional segment, has to do with me helping you hit more solid, short and long approach shots. That would include full swings and less than full swing uh, chips and pitches. Okay. First thing we have to embrace about solid contact is what we call impact, the moment of truth of the golf swing. We have to learn about what happens at impact, what we're trying to uh, acquire at impact. So I'm going to show you through some drills here uh, exactly what we're going to try to do there. Okay. Impact in this case has everything to do about the divot. So today it's about the divot. What we see commonly in the golf swing, if we look at the golf swing as a circle as I have here, you see the bottom of the circle is where we want to have the proper contact on the return back to the ball. Most of our middle to high handicappers don't have that skill. So what we try to do when we work on that is to find out where their bottom of the swing is. So this is an exercise that I'll give them uh, you can just put two balls down to form a imaginary line for but for today for the camera purposes I'm going to have a line on the ground so what I'll have the student do is take a series of swings and if you notice where the club is landing we see a variety of places where the club lands so the bottom of the swing for your middle to high handicapper is not where it should be where it should be which is somewhat surprising is the divot is actually in front of the ball. So that means the bottom of the swing will move to in front of the ball. So for this exercise, I'll have them strive to try to make the divot on that line or forward. And their, their ability to learn how to do that, to control where the ball hits the ground, will ultimately define how good a ball striker they become, okay? So let's talk about, that's great feedback. Let's talk about how to accomplish the divot in front of the ball. And a lot of it is just a mental thought process of trying to find that circle. The bottom of that circle moves in front of that line. So we're actually gonna hit the ball on the way to the divot, okay? The loft of the club will get the ball up in the air if it bottoms out properly, okay? So when we are having good impact, we're creating a more steep angle, and I've got these rods here to show a good impact angle, steep down to the bottom in front of the line. And if you notice where my legs are, they're forward. That's the new bottom of the swing. So we're steep, a little forward shift, bottom of the swing in front of the line. We're gonna hit the ball on the way to the divot, like we said. Okay, so a good exercise here to create that steepness in order to get the ball launching. Again, I've got a, a lofted club here. Is a time-tested drill I've been using for years is just put something behind the ball to encourage getting a good visual of how the club needs to be elevated in order to get a good impact and hit the ball first and make a divot in front. And move through. Pay attention to those concepts. That's your tip of the day.